Hey guys, Tyler Ansman here with Tyler Ans Performance and another installment of our short shorts. This one is gonna be on warming up the posterior shoulder for throwing gas. All right, so we know that layback is an important part of high velocity throwing and health in terms of uh, you know being on the mound, throwing at a high velocity and kind of maintaining that throughout the season. So how do we warm up for that? Here's, how we, here's one of the ways we do it here at TAP. So the first one is gonna be, you're gonna be on the ground going through a release of the infraspinatus and other parts of the posterior shoulder. So we'll be kind of working through this internal and external rotation range of motion. Um, we'll take somewhere between 30 and 120 seconds there. We don't want to take a ton of time. What this is going to do, it's going to open up. Uh, it's going to make some acute range of motion changes. All right, but then what we need to do with this is kind of lock in that range of motion. So we need to kind of add some stimulus neuromuscularly to kind of give us that range in, an, in a usable way so we can kind of take that into our session that day. Okay, so here's one of the ways we like to do that is with a prone external rotation liftoff. So you want to use some kind of implement that's going to be near your end range of motion so that you're forced to kind of drive this maximal intent in terms of lifting off and holding that. You may get some cramping in the posterior shoulder. We'll hold this for somewhere between kind of 10 and 30 seconds. We'll probably build towards 30 seconds. Start on the lower end if you're going to be using this prior to a throwing session when you begin and then you can kind of gradually build it up. Main thing here is maximal intent is super important. In order to drive an adaptation, we have to produce enough stress to make that happen. All right, thanks for watching another episode of our short shorts. Uh, drop any questions you have below and don't forget to subscribe.